Welcome. Let's talk about how we can find the area of any polygon in the coordinate plane. For this example, we're going to consider a triangle where the three vertices are a negative 6, comma, negative 1, 6, comma, 3, and negative 3, comma, 10. Let's start by putting those points in the coordinate plane. Now let's connect those points to create our triangle. And remember that what we're interested in is to find the area inside this triangle. We're going to enclose this triangle inside of a square. When we place our figure inside of a rectangle, notice that we have created different right triangles. The one on the left, the one on the right, and the one on the bottom. So if we're interested on the area inside this purple triangle, then what we can do, we can find the area of the rectangle and subtract the area of those three right triangles that we have defined. Let's start by finding the area of the rectangle. The base, it is of a length of 12, and the height, it is of a length of 11. That is a total of 132. Let's say that the measurements are given in centimeters, so the area is centimeters squared. Now let's call this triangle, triangle 1. It will be 1 half times the base, which notice at the base, it's of a length of 3, times a height, which is a length of 11. That will give us a total of 16.5. Let's call this triangle, triangle 2. Let's find the area of that triangle. It will be 1 half times the base, where the base, it's of a length of 9, and the height, it's of a length of 7. And that is a total of 31.5. Let's call this right triangle, triangle 3, and let's find the area of that triangle. It will be 1 half times the base, where the base has a length of 4, times the height, where the height is of a length of 12, which is equivalent to 24. So now we have all the information that is needed to find the area of the triangle that we were interested on. Because if we take the area of the whole square, which we found it to be 132, and we subtract the area of the first triangle, which we found it to be of 16.5, and we subtract the area of the second triangle, which was 31.5, and we subtract the area of the third triangle, which was 24, then we will get a total of 16 centimeters square. So we have properly found the area that is inside the triangle that we were interested in. Hello, if you would like to continue learning about mathematics, you can check out the videos on the left. 